all is vanity. Ecclesiastes 1 and 14 I have seen all the works that are done under the sun, and behold, all is vanity and a vexation of spirit. Proverbs 31 and 10 Who can find a virtuous woman? For her price is far above rubies. The heart of her husband doeth safely trust in her, so that he have no need of spoil. She will do him good and not evil all the days of her life. She seeketh wool and flax, and worketh willingly with her hands. She is like the merchant ship, she bringeth her food from afar. She riseth also while it is yet night, and giveth meat to her household, and a portion to her maidens. She considereth the field, and buyeth it. With the fruit of her hands she planted a vineyard. She girded her loins of strength, and strengthened her arms. She laid her hands to the spindle, her hands holded his staff. She stretched out her hand to the poor, yea, she reached her hand out to the needy. She is not afraid of snow for her household, for all her household are clothed with scarlet. She maketh her cover in tapestry, and her clothing is silk and purple. Her husband is known in the gates when he sitteth among the elders of the land. She maketh fine linen, and selleth it, and delivereth girdles unto the merchants. Strength and honor are her clothing. She shall rejoice in the time to come. She opened her mouth of wisdom, and her tongue is the law of kindness. She looketh well to the ways of her household, and eateth not the bread of idleness. Her children arise and call her blessed. Her husband also and praiseth her. Many daughters have done virtuously, but thou excellest them all. Favor is deceitful, and beauty is vain. But a woman that feareth Yahuwah, she shall be praised. Matthew chapter 4 verse 1 Then was Yahushua led up of the Spirit into the wilderness to be tempted of the devil. And when he had fasted forty days and forty nights, he was afterwards a hungered. And when the tempter came to him, he said, If thou be the son of Elohim, command that these stones be made bread. But he answered and said, it is written, Man shall not live by bread alone, but by every word that proceeded out of the mouth of Yahuwah. Ecclesiastes 6, verse 7 All the labor of a man is for his mouth, yet his appetite is not filled. A woman dries mud cookies in the sun on the roof of Fort Manche, once a prison in Port-au-Prince, Haiti. Rising food prices and food shortages are threatening Haiti's fragile stability. And the mud cookies made of dirt, salt, and vegetable shortening are one of the very few options the poorest people have to starve off hunger. This photograph showing a starving Sudanese child being stalked by a vulture won Kevin Carter the 1994 Pulitzer Prize for Feature Photography. Proverbs 30, verse 8 Remove from me vanity and lies. Give me neither poverty nor riches. Feed me with food convenient for me. Ecclesiastes 1 verse 18 For in much wisdom is much grief, and he that increaseth in knowledge increaseth sorrow. Ecclesiastes 12 verse 1 Remember now thy Creator in thy youth, while the evil days come not, nor the years draw near, when thou shalt say, I have no pleasure in them, while the sun or the lights or the moon or the stars be not darkened, nor the clouds return after the rain. Ecclesiastes 11 verse 9 Rejoice, O young man, in thy youth. Let thine heart cheer thee in the days of thy youth, and walk in thy ways of thine heart, and in the sight of thine eyes. But know thou that for all these things Yahuwah will judge thee in judgment. Therefore remove sorrow from thy heart, put away evil from thy flesh, for childhood and youth are vanity. Ecclesiastes 3 and 16 Moreover I saw under the sun the place of judgment, that wickedness was there, and the place of righteousness, 
that iniquity was there. I said in mine heart, Yahuwah shall judge the righteous and the wicked, for there is a time for every purpose and for every work. Can video games make children more violent? A new study employing state-of-the-art scanning technology says the answer may be yes. Researchers say brain scans of children who played a violent video game showed an increase of emotional arousal and a corresponding decrease in activity in brain areas involved in self-control, inhibition, and attention. Isaiah 2 and 4, Nations shall not lift up sword against nation, neither shall they learn war any more. Ecclesiastes 5 verse 15 As he came forth of his mother's womb, naked shall he return as he came, and shall take nothing of his labor, which he may carry away in his hand. Matthew 6 verse 19 Lay not up for yourselves treasures upon earth, where moth and rust doeth corrupt, where thieves break through and steal. But lay up for yourselves treasures in heaven, where neither moth nor rust doeth corrupt, and where thieves do not break through nor steal. For where your treasure is, there will your heart be also. Matthew 19 verse 21 And Yahushua said unto him, If thou wilt be perfect, go and sell that thou hast, and give to the poor, and thou shalt have treasure in heaven, and come and follow me. But when the young man heard that saying, he went away sorrowful, for he had great possessions. Then said Yahushua unto his disciples, Verily I say unto you, that a rich man shall hardly enter into the kingdom of heaven. And again I say unto you, It is easier for a camel to go through an eye of a needle, than for a rich man to enter into the kingdom of Yahuwah. Ecclesiastes 5 verse 10 he that loveth silver shall not be satisfied with silver, nor he that loveth abundance with increase. This also is vanity. When goods increase, they are increased that eat them. And what good is there to the owners thereof, save in the beholden of them with their eyes? The sleep of a laboring man is sweet, whether he eat little or much, but the abundance of the rich will not suffer him to sleep. Psalms chapter 4 verse 2 O ye sons of men, how long will you turn my glory into shame? How long will you love vanity and seek after leeson? But know that Yahuwah hath set apart him that is godly for himself. For Yahuwah will hear when I call unto him. Job 3 verse 17 There the wicked cease from troubling. There the weary be at rest. There the prisoners rest together. They hear not the voice of the oppressors. The small and great are there. The servant is free from his master. Wherefore is light given to him that is in misery, and life unto the bitter in soul, which long for death, but it cometh not, and dig for it more than high treasures, which rejoice exceedingly, and are glad when they can find the grave. Why is light given to a man whose way is hid, and whom Yahuwah hath hedged in? For my sighing cometh before I eat, and my roarings are poured out like the waters. For the thing which I greatly feared is come upon me, and that which I was afraid of is come unto me. And I was not in safety, neither had I rest, neither was I quiet, yet trouble came. Ecclesiastes 4 verse 7 Then I returned and I saw vanity under the sun. There is one alone, and there is not a second. Yea, he hath neither child nor brother, yet there is no end of all his labor. Neither is I satisfied at riches, neither saith he, For whom do I labor, and brave my soul of good? This also is vanity, yea, it is a sore travail. Two are better than one, because they have good reward for their labor. For if they fall, one will lift up the fellow. But woe unto them that is alone when he falleth, for he hath not another to help him. Again, if two lie together, then they have heat. But how can one be warm alone? If one prevail against him, two shall withstand him, and a threefold cord is not quickly broken. Ecclesiastes 9 verse 9 Live joyfully with the wife whom thou lovest all the days of thy life of thy vanity, which he hath given thee under the sun, all the days of thy vanity, for that is thy portion in this life and in thy labor, which thou takest under the sun. Ecclesiastes 12 and 13 
Let us hear the conclusion of the whole matter. Fear Yahuwah and keep his commandments, for this is the whole duty of man. For Yahuwah shall bring every work into judgment with every secret thing, whether it be good or whether it be evil.